Welcome to Tuesday. I just finished up my classes. It's uh, 1.35, so you see the M5? It's down here in my traditional corner spot. I'm gonna jump in that, get home. Um, if it doesn't rain, I wanted to get the last mow done across the street. Get that all cleaned up. I owe them one more cut anyways, and then we're gonna be done with that. This is my signature spot. Even got a leaf in my grill. All right, I'm going home. Yeah, it's an ECS order, and it's uh, a few minutes after three o'clock. Look at that. This is a washer bottle cap for probably about any BMW. I don't think they changed those a whole lot. But there it is, and I got to get another one. I replaced this January 20th, 2012. Why I know that date, no idea. But uh, now I get a new one because Kenan took my old one off and dropped it on my exhaust manifold and it melted and then it fell out and got lost. So I've been riding dirty with no exhaust, no, uh, no wiper fluid tank reservoir cap on a filled up tank. Good news is it didn't blow out anywhere because it has like this long stock stem thing that then goes into the reservoir. So that's good thinking to avoid sloshing and spilling. So you're gonna witness the install here firsthand. This is really complicated. It takes years and years and years of experience to master. We open the hood, we locate the reservoir and without dropping it, <coughs> Kenan, we snap it on. Look how freaking easy that is, bud. All right, job's done. Now I'm going to go mow. Did that shut? No, it didn't shut. Damn it. There we go. I'm gonna go mow across the street and, uh, and get that done. And I don't think I'm gonna blow here just because there's more up there and ride. why do it twice if I can do it once? Uh, so I'm gonna go even at the grass over there, take off a couple leaves, and then we're done with them for the year. Already done with them for the year. And all I have to do over here is, well, all I have to do is clean up that maple tree, oak tree, which is a piece of shit and drops all of its leaves over the next 18 months. So it's gonna be a fun afternoon. It's on slideshow mode. Listen to what we're listening to. It's Guantanamera. I love that song. I listen to it when I'm mowing. I don't know, I do, I do weird things sometimes. It's uh, 7.51 p.m. Rosvan got bored, so we dropped by for a little bit, and then he just left, so we're gonna jump on here and do some work. Hey, Luke, check it out. That's the USS Midway in San Diego. That's a Ferrari, California. You guys probably remember most of this. If I found it picture-worthy, I probably found it vlog-worthy. Yep. <laughs> yep, name what car that's off of. You should know. You probably remember that. And then flying home. All right, I'm gonna get my work done. Yes. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm distracting myself. I'm, I'm gonna run back to work now. Ha! Yeah. Okay, so guess what? It's not 5 a.m. It's still 8 o'clock. Um, looking for some lights. There we go. So my Yahoo account, my primary Yahoo account, um, the last several hours has been giving me errors, um, saying that my password isn't right. And since that's such a common thing in iOS for it to say, oh, cannot get mail, I just neglected to, to look at it until Sparrow on the Mac did the same thing. So I don't know what's going on with that, but I logged in and reset the password and now that works. Now that of course brought in like 25 new emails that I hadn't gotten since they were in that account. Um, and I've been going through those and guess what sold? Something I have had listed on eBay since January 20th, 2012. So that's been like one and three quarter years I've had this thing listed on eBay. So I'm coming down here to get it out of my parts box right now. I gotta move this out of here. This this needs to go in the parts box. That's my broken light. I'm not a pack rat. I'm keeping that for the bulb. I have a bunch of those lights on the car and all my friends have those lights. So if we need bulbs, I have it. This is the car box, car, car parts box. I don't know if you guys have seen this. Get this down here. This is all full of my hoard of automotive parts and the one that finally sold after almost two years better still be here here it is this i this was originally in my car so this is alcantara and it does not have the the cutout for the home link 
with a uh, garage door opener. So I bought the Homelink unit and one that had a cutout for it. This was made January 26th, 2000. My car is in production February, so I mean it's beautiful. It's in really nice shape. There's one clip broken, but I advertised that in the selling. It does not affect how it how it holds up. But finally, now that's sold, I got my money for it, and it's going to Brooklyn, New York. Actually, Staten Island. The the shipping address is in Staten Island, but the payment address was in Brooklyn. So it probably works in Brooklyn and then takes the ferry over from the island. Yeah. So I got that whole box full of parts. I'm gonna throw my light in there. Um, <laughs> this is the sound deadening material that I used to shut up my rear deck. I guess I'll keep that in here. That's my original center console. This is a trimble. When you take your Mark II out and put a Mark IV in, you no longer need your trimble. So maybe some of you will find that interesting. That's a center console handle that's in shit condition. This, this is Colt's, uh, I gave him my old one, that's why I have this. This is Colt's e-brake handle boot. Notice it's sand beige on the other side, spray painted black. That's a real beaut right there. Everything. You name it, you name something I've replaced on that car, I probably still have the original. There's two of these lights. So there's two perfect bulbs, that's the original to the car. I got those. This, I don't know why I'm keeping that, it doesn't work. That can go, that is a PDC sensor. I'll have to go through this sometime. There's my old washer bottle cap. Should have just used that. There's high beams for headlights. Luke, you could have had those, but you are, you're not here. So I got valve stem caps and I'm boring you, but everything's still in there. In addition to my uh, Hella original OEM pre-facelift 2000 headlights, Eurospec in there. Well, kind of Eurospec. Oh my. <laughs> Look at this. This is like 10 pounds of shredded paper that I had just produced by cleaning out my papers and other papers. Stuff that is now going to be put in the back of the car, hopefully taken over to the school and eliminated. Oh yeah. Okay, consider that done. We're gonna do some camera testing now in 1080. See what things look like. We'll allow it to focus how it thinks it should there. And we'll play. I don't know what it's going to be able to do. That's not bad. When you zoom out, it kind of doesn't know what to do with the light. I'm going to try some pictures now. Okay, so now it is late. It's not even that late. It's just after 12 o'clock. Um, drop those papers off. So those are all gone. Um, thanks to Ken, I got some silicon spray. So I just did all my door seals. Uh, kind of a messy job, but now they feel really nice and hopefully will last longer. What else did I do? I mowed across the street today. I got that taken care of, so he and I are square for the winter. So I got my four cuts in. I've got leaves to do here still. I've got an exam tomorrow, so I'm going to brush up on that stuff. Shouldn't be too bad. Um, it's pretty much going to be it for tomorrow. I have my normal class then later, which is just going to be notes. All the work for it is done. And then Thursday is going to be normal, and then the 11th is coming. That's going to be good. Um, got to ship that thing tomorrow. Oh God, it's been a busy week, and it's not over yet. But the end is the end is in sight. So I'm going to go and take care of the emails and the YouTubes and all that stuff that gets done 40 million times a day. And those are the notes I need to touch up on. Okay, that's going to be it. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow on uh, Wednesday.